Hey everyone, Jojo here from Joyroot Jojo. This is the 15th video in my Intune video tutorial series. In today's video, we are diving into Microsoft Intune and especially how to deploy custom applications you have developed for your company. As an administrator, you might have a specific in-house applications that need to distribute to a designated user group. So we will walk you through the entire process step by step. See, I have a custom application in .msi format that we will deploy using Intune. Let's get started. Log into intune.microsoft.com uh, to the endpoint uh, admin center. Navigate to Apps Blade in the left hand pan. Click on that. Click on All Apps. This will display all currently deployed application for different platforms. In my case, you could see uh, some application for Google from the Google Play Store, some are for the Android App Store, some are for the iOS Store apps and Windows apps. So all these we could see here. Now to, to, to deploy a custom app, we have to click on Add button here. Select a app type. In our case, since it is a custom application for your organization, choose line of business. So you could see line of business app here under other on the category of other you could see line of business app click on that so as a quick refresher line of business apps are applications developed internally or acquired from a third party vendor to fulfill specific business needs for your organization these apps are typically not available on the public application stores and are tailored to your organization unique requirement so here it shows the supported file extensions let's read this to add a custom or house app upload app installation file make sure the file extension matches the apps intended platform in tune support the following line of business app platform and extensions so it support apk android dot apk file format ios ipa file format mac os dot pkg dot pkg format and for the windows key in the case of windows it support msi dot ppx and msi x uh, msi x bundle so all these format it supported so we select this select the package file for your application for your app so we upload the package file here so i select my uh, my custom application here and uh, upload that file here click on ok now here you can provide the basic details about that applications like name description publisher and other details name you can give the application a clear and descriptive name for easy identification so i name it as uh, monitor agent monitor agent and description uh, you can give a detailed description here in my case i'm just putting it as monitor agent Publisher, you can give the publisher name. I don't have a specific uh, publisher name to be specified here, so I just mentioned agent. Only these four options are mandatory. If you require, you can provide it uh, here and uh, click on next. Here comes the assignment. Choose the appropriate user group. Uh, in our case, this application which we have selected is used to monitor the security breaches on the laptop for the retailer shop uses. So I have to select that particular group. Uh, particular group as it's a lab environment i just allocate to add all users and all devices in your case make sure you allocate to the appropriate group and click on next and create it the deployment process will take time normally it may take up to 24 hours uh, or 48 hours to get reflected on all the machines get installed on all the machines so you can monitor it in the uh, monitor tab here and the uh, devices installation status you can check it out so in my case it's not installed in any of the devices if you go to the overview uh, you could see presently it is not installed with any of the machines uh, it, it will take some time like uh, up to 24 hours to 48 hours it will be it takes to get reflected on all the machines so that's it if you find this video is helpful for you please do subscribe and like this channel if you have any suggestions or questions, please mark it in the comment section. We will meet you in the other video. Till then, goodbye.